We'll begin by drawing the head which will help us establish the body's proportions. Once you've finished the head, draw the neck. Here, we'll give it a long, thin shape. Now, draw the shoulders. Draw the outline of the dress. Now, we can begin to draw the dress. Here, we will draw the neck similar to a traditional Chinese dress. This type of dress is often made with a very light material, like silk. But since the dress fits tightly, you don't need to draw many folds. For an original design, we will draw a different style of sleeve. We will use a very light, transparent material. Be sure to draw the folds and arm carefully. Also, remember to mark the separation between both materials at the shoulders. Now we're going to create the bottom of the dress. The material is the same as the sleeves. Under the first set of fabric, there is a second set, made with fabric like cotton which is more flexible, so the lines are straighter. Draw the line of the seam on the side. Draw the second arm. Now, we're going to give her a small fur bag. Drawing fur is similar to drawing a person's hair right after they've gotten out of bed in the morning. It will look a bit messy, and no two strands should look alike.
Now, draw the legs. If you want to add some detail to the top portion of the dress, you can find different types of patterns for Chinese dresses. 